The valuation principle is one of the most important principles in finance. The valuation principle notes that we wish to accept projects for which the benefits exceed the costs. The idea here is that whenever the benefits are greater than the costs, then firm value is going to increase. And we know from Chapter 1 that the goal of the firm is to maximize shareholder value, which it does by maximizing share price, which it does by accepting all possible positive net present value projects. We're assuming we have competitive market prices where no single buyer or seller has control over the prices. And with that assumption, let's look at an example. Please pause and take a moment to read this problem. We have a situation where we can get a benefit that costs $25,000. What is the actual value of that benefit? Well, we can buy 2,000 pounds of, of, we can buy 200 barrels of oil. So 200 barrels of oil at $90 a barrel, that is 18,000 in today's dollars. And 3,000 pounds of copper at 350 per pound of copper that's 10,500 so adding these together 28,500 the cost to get an equivalent amount of something worth 28,500 is 25,000 so that is a benefit of $3,500 this means that if this opportunity is taken, the value of the firm is going to increase by $3,500. Because the value is positive, we should take it. Only current prices matter in a competitive market. Our own opinion about future prospects for oil or copper, they don't matter. That's not going to change the positive value of the decision today. If I make this decision today and buy 200 barrels of oil and 3,000 pounds of copper for $25,000, I will have made $3,500 because today the oil and the copper together is worth $28,500.